finagling to get all this stuff in there but I think I've got it so I have two front bags and two back saddle bags um, for our two bicycles and then Rob is currently dealing with the triangle bag he's trying to figure out which bike to bring the uh, 51 frame that he was hoping to ride does not fit our current triangle bag we used to put it on a titanium bike that had thinner tubing so it was a little bit easier to fit it into the triangle so here are the four bags that are going to go on our two bikes, front and back, minus the triangle bag. It's way different. I mean, that one's way more slanted, the 51. This is almost flat across. Okay. It's a matter of like space up here and like this.
24. We're going from this red line to the orange line. All the way over there. Okay. 1510 meters. Woo! Go Toge. Great pass. What are we now? Uh, five, not even 500. 480. 480. We know it's at like 500. We have like a thousand meters. Yep, thousand meter pass. Ah. Uh, yep. Okay. No biggie. No biggie. <laughs> Okay. Oh yeah, that was open. Have. Yeah. Yeah, I saw one that had bananas at least. So. <laughs> Mac <Mets> and cheese. <laughs> and some coffee. Milky coffee. Brought to you by this cow. A spicy curry. And a cream bun. I'm having the. Top. Woohoo! Gunma is such a tiny sign. Look at the tiny sign on the other side for Gunma. <laughs> Gunma's like, we're not even gonna put it in English. <laughs> Alrighty, ready for this descent? Let's yeah. get down to some warm food yes. and a warm tent. Lovely day. Looked in it. Good. Got that haze moving in. What you doing over here? Oh, just a little, uh, little laundering. <laughs> laundering. You trying to dry out the tent? Trying. I am succeeding wildly beyond <laughs> your greatest expectations. Wow, that's pure innovation. <laughs> Come on, there's sun plus hot air coming from the air conditioner. <laughs> Could you ask for a better drying situation? Nope. Good job. It's gonna smell like a convenience store tonight. My favorite smell. <laughs> 6 11 a.m. Day two, let's do it. like 0% visibility once we got up to the high point where you could actually see stuff. So unfortunately after all that hard work we still didn't catch a good view but today, today is gorgeous. We have like fluffy clouds, blue skies, and you can see all of the surrounding mountains. Yatsukitake, you can see Akagi. I could not ask for a better day than today. Let's hope it, let's hope the weather stays like this for the rest of the day and maybe into tomorrow too. That would be perfect. A 
screw in my shoe. Down to one bolt for now. <laughs> That's not good. Nope. Oh, I hope that one is enough. Give it a nice torque down and the best. Right there. Wow, it's so clear. It's so. We'll probably get a good shot. Yeah, you can see it. Wow. You can actually see it. Hey, yeah, this could be, this road could be above it, and that could be a tunnel that passes between these two roads. Okay. But I don't think it looks like an intersection. It looks more like a tunnel or something. There's not even an image of the. This is definitely a tunnel, see? Convenient. There's not an image, no. Okay. That's why I'm a little like skeptical now. Yeah. Well, the nice thing is there are buildings around, so we can yeah, always go around and around. ask if there's some water. How far back was it? Like kilometer. One kilometer? Yeah. One kilometer of eight eight percent? Yeah. It's not so bad. Yeah, it just sucks because we don't have water either, you know, or we didn't get to refill our water. Yeah. But I'm like, is there even just some place, you know, just looking around if there's like a tap or something. This is the Nakasendo. Yep, this is what's left of it. Oh man. I think that happened during Hagabus? Yeah, definitely. Dang. I was on this last year. All right, well, let's find a different route.